we're talking about. Piranha Plant shouldn't be here. But let's talk about Fox and Diddy Kong. God, hold on. I'm pulling up a video. Go ahead and talk. I'll talk about Fox and Diddy Kong. Cool. This I'm looking up a speed matchup. This matchup, a.k.a. Mix. This matchup is all about the mix. Fox hits him, you're getting mixed. Diddy Kong hits you, you're getting mixed. Okay, so we have a Goomba. We have a block. Goomba. Pipe. Another Goomba. Two Goombas. I didn't see any Piranha Plant. He went down below. I don't know what's going on anymore. Maybe, he maybe went too fast. Maybe, okay, maybe he's anyway. going too fast for the Piranha Plant to spawn. I haven't seen any Koopas. I've just seen nothing but Goombas. He beat the level. Okay, we're done. Yeah, that's it. It's over. I don't know, man. That's how you speed run it. Dill versus our hungry. Yes. Our hungry rocking the fox. Mm. I wonder why. He has a. I mean, a, a playing zero suit against Diddy Kong is asking for a loss sometimes. I haven't seen our hungry rock that zero suit in years. Yeah. Yeah. He's he's pretty much corn now. Really? He went over to Fox. Fox he is did, his strong right. secondary. I was thinking about the old R Hungry. Yeah. So I remember he went he went corn uh uh two weeks ago. I specifically Ugh. remember the glue eating joke. It's gonna land right on him. Yeah, I mean, my man exploded. But Dill, you know, the uh, beast of Xeno, doesn't re uh, refuses to let people win this weekly lately, except <laughs> for like the spooktacular last week. But that was because it was Halloween, you know, it was Dill Friday. Has, he Freaky has such Wednesday. a simple, like, gameplay to me. Like, I know, it pisses me off. Looking at his He's gameplay. He's so boring. <laughs> no, exactly, no disrespect. You look at his gameplay, and I don't understand how he makes it so far. And, like, he just beats everybody. He plays safe. He plays as safe as possible. It's like, what? Well, that's, that's, that's a shtick. And you know what? It, it is respectable. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I'm trying to say stuff to trigger Devin. That's all. Before you uh, before you know it, you're getting destroyed and two-stocked by his Diddy Kong. Nothing fancy. None of these pop gun cancels and B reverses and all that. Just take this down smash and GG's. Okay. Simple punish. Just wait for the Fox Illusion to get back on stage. There aren't too many characters that can punish Fox Illusion after they've rolled. He rolled backwards and punched uh, and punished the illusion. Trying to go for that forward air. Our hunger becoming a little bit too high. Dill trying to mix up how he's going to lay down on the ground. For that B reversal. Back air. Nothing. Our hunger is going to stay his feet on the ground. Now, as oppressive as Fox is, he. Oh. As oppressive as Fox is, he gets to a point where he just can't kill you too easily. You kind of got to let him kill you. And that seems to be what had happened. Nonetheless, Dill didn't really give him too many opportunities. Got a counter pick coming out. Uh, go into I like it. I like it. I've seen him go toe-to-toe -to -toe -to -toe with uh, Angel Cortez. Who? Angel? Who's that? Angel uh, Cortez? Oh, uh, Angel, Angel Gormez? I know Angel him. Angel Gormez? Yes. Angel, Angel Gormez. I know Angel <laughs> Gormez. Angel? Final <laughs> destination. Taking it back. We already got this. Oh, my. He almost got a kill off of yeah. that. Yeah. Our Hungry was... definitely feeling himself. That's something that our Hungry does really well. Once he puts you in disadvantage, he knows how to make you pay for it. Or at least make you sweat. Okay, spacing out these forward airs. Nice. Pretty sure he doesn't want that peel. Yeah, he wanted to jab, but he ended up just picking up the banana. Our hungry understanding if he lands on the banana with down air, it'll cancel out the, the end lag, so that's what he tried to do. Good, he's at Goss he has him without jumps. I mean, Dill had to go for that immediate rocket barrel boost, because he our hungry was already trying to like get that uh gimp. Super early gimp, might I add. Okay. I hope he's doing a good job playing around this banana. He hasn't got tripped too many times. He's understanding where he needs to stay. Not too far, not too close. Down tilt, up air. Not going to do it. Not just yet. Not going to be able to get that bouncy fish afterwards a little bit too high. Dill just kind of spaghettiing all over the ground. I think he yeah. thought he had his double jump still. Yeah, did he just air dodge twice? That looks weird. Nonetheless, oh, I'm going to take that stock. Sitting very comfortably. Nice. Forward throw, fair. Uh, not going to connect that last fair, so that bouncing fish not going to do it. It's not safe, my guy. Yeah, bouncing fish behind the opponent. <laughs> he, just let, he let him land for free just now. Didn't throw the banana, didn't do anything. So many safe options he could have done. Didn't do anything. 
Now you see how Hungry kind of adapted. Uh, Dill is trying to pick his spots a little bit, but uh, he doesn't understand what to do. So he's slowing down, which is good, because now he has to figure it out. Good catch. Playing down with that forward air, pushing him off stage. Again, you'll notice our hungry just trying to throw out those up airs, but we got Dill with the nice. correct amount of charge after the, the up stop. smash, after the banana peel. You know, that, that's a pretty common combo you'll see from Diddy. Okay, now this is good. Coming in uh, from the Angel platform, our hungry didn't have any momentum. He immediately got offensive, got Dill off the platform. Now the momentum's right back in our hungry's favor, which is good. Oh, gonna catch that side B again. One more time. Just misses it. I mean, when you're Diddy calling off stage with no jumps, side B tends to become one of your best friends. Yeah, it, it's your only friend. Yeah, <laughs> literally. <laughs> Sometimes it's a, it, it'll backstab you because you come obvious nice. like that. Great air dodge read coming out from our hungry. The reeds. The reeds. Those are nice colors for the uh, the Aeon uh, promo. And this fun size mini. I don't know who that is, but I always see fun size mini. She does artwork. She's really cool. Hi, fun size mini. My name is Godfinet. You can I, follow me at xgodfinet on Twitter. I, I don't think she's in the chat. You should be. Fun size mini. Hello. So we're going to jump into uh, another game. Have, uh, game number three between uh, oh Dill and R. Hungry. No, I want fun size mini. This is your captain speaking. Fun size meaning, can you report to first class? Okay, town and city. Stopping that immediately. Sticking with the Sheik. I mean, the Sheik counter pick actually ended up helping him out. Yeah, really good. I mean, our hungry, he's always had some form of the Sheik, but I've seen him play Sheik a lot in friendlies, especially with Riz, so it's only getting better. And why not pick up a, a really good Sheik in this last month before Ultimate? Yep. I mean, like I say, it, it's a character that just kind of relies heavily on neutral. Again, he's been doing a fantastic job of stuffing out those monkey flips. I think that... Uh, Sheik is definitely going to be one of those characters that everybody's going to try and pick up early on, as well as Mario. Look at Sheik. She's just uh, so good, man. Needles. Needles. You know, I didn't, we didn't see uh, Hungry throwing too many needles last game. Yeah, I mean, maybe he just wasn't feeling it to himself, but now he allows him to play. He's, again, he's starting to pick up on Dill's habit of immediately trying to recover high all yeah. the time. And not just recovering, uh, not just like side being, he's jumping and side being. So now he's losing his jump and he's getting red. Tries to go for the breakdance down smash. Forward throw. Here we go. Okay, now you let him set up. This isn't yeah. good. Ugh. The longer you chill on that platform, the more time Diddy Kong has to, to set up like his banana peel trap. Be able to just option select the crap yeah. out of you. And it sucks because if now, if, if he picks up on the habit that you're recovering quickly, you're trying to get on the stage quickly, he could punish you for that too. So Diddy's mix is uh, never ending. Four throw. Oh, did you? Set up super far. I was about to say, did you DI that way? Threw nice. the banana peel downwards towards the man. Thank you. Oh, I'm surprised that didn't connect. Bouncing Fish hitbox is pretty large. Here we go. All right. Dill opting to just keep stage control, then throws out a random <laughs> side B uh, monkey flip with the kick. Monkey kick. Monkey gonna take kick? the stock. That's not it. Monkey kick. Monkey flip. Monkey flip. But kick. it turns into a kick. Monkey flip to kick. Yeah. Because the monkey flip can turn into a command grab or a kick. kick. Yeah, it flip it to kick. The flip it to kick. The flip it to kick. 126%. Trying to catch him with that up air after the forward tilt. I mean, at this point, forward tilt would definitely like send him pretty far high into the air. Not have to get the kill just yet. Mm -hmm. So you're trying to get that. Uh, it's tough, man. S super, super spot. You gotta be good Sweet with Sheik spot. to uh, be able to kill at this point. Or just keep on hitting them until they get to 230%. Nice catch Ooh. again. Following the monkey flip. Yep. Now you got our hungry playing super safe. Okay. Nice reactions on that uh, tech roll in. Hungry doing a good job of um, rolling out of down tilt pressure. Anytime uh, Dill gets some kind of down tilt, Hungry knows exactly how to get out of it so he's not in the mix. Because it's not true. 
It's not like you can you just have to keep getting hit. There's a way to get out, but you gotta be fast. Gets the, such a big charge on yeah. that forward smash. Again, not enough to get the kill just yet. Arangi putting up quite the fight against Dill here. Yeah. But he is starting to rack up a ton of damage. Already sitting at 107. Off stage. Gets rid of the banana peel. Yeah. And but I mean, every single time he charges Needle Storm, you, you see Diddy Kong spawning banana peel. So yeah. it's like, whose projectile is more important? Exactly. Hungry. I feel like Hungry is uh, charging needles. He's staying out of range where he's not able to punish. Um the banana pool. He has to stay close enough to punish banana pool, but far enough to react to whatever uh, Dill throws out. Great dunk on that back here. Trying to get the vanish a little bit too far away, and he paid it all with that vanish. If he would have connected it, that would have been his game. Oh but Dill was just a slightly to the right of him. That was absolutely Diddy privilege. Just now. No bias. I love our hungry from Jersey. But that was Diddy privilege just now. He, he read dodged. the air dodge. But that's that's not a Diddy thing. He just air dodged. Nah. That